President Donald Trump gave a speech about his Asia, Asia trip yesterday. Here's the coverage from the CBS Evening News. President Trump today gave an account of his Asia trip that appeared for a time might run as long as the 12-day journey itself. His mouth got so dry he had to stop and search for a bottle of water to quench his thirst. And a few minutes later, it happened again. You'll recall Mr. Trump on the campaign trail mocked then-rival Marco Rubio for taking a water break as he delivered the GOP response to a State of the Union address. Within moments today, Senator Rubio pounced with this review of the president. Needs work on his form, has to be done in one single motion, and eyes should never leave the camera, but not bad for his first time. Tweet revenge. So, so that was 44 seconds long, and unfortunately, that left CBS no time whatsoever to cover the corruption trial of Democrat Senator Bob Menendez, or all, as he is also known by me, Sleaze Bob No Pants, who is widely believed to have had sex with underage prostitutes while taking bribes from his eye doctor buddy. And while every establishment Republican and his mother is calling for Roy Moore to step down, Democrat leader Dick Durbin had this to say when he was asked whether he would call for Menendez to step down if he was convicted. If your colleague, Senator Bob Menendez, New Jersey Democrat, is convicted on the corruption charges, he's on trial right now, the jury is still deliberating, will you vote to expel him? I'm not going to get into the hypotheticals <laughs> on either of these situations. As I said, several steps removed. Uh, I'm hopeful that when all is said and done that Bob Menendez will be returning to the Senate representing the state of New Jersey. So why have the Democrats and the mainstream media lost all credibility in their war against Donald Trump? It is a mystery, but we're going to explore it today. Also, Dr. Sebastian Gorka is with us to tell us what is going on with the GOP. Trigger warning, I'm Andrew Claven, and this is The Andrew Claven Show.